part of the you know resource persons for the program that took place on Monday. I'm talking about the National Dialogue on Galamse. How did you see the whole event? How did it go for you? Well, thank you very much again, Dave, and good morning to our wonderful listeners out there. Um, and thank you for the opportunity to also contribute to this discussion. Very important to me. So while on the panel, I thought that um, a lot of us were very diplomatic in handling the issue. And, well, it's a very sensitive one, and so I understand. And that, that's how I saw it. We didn't want to arouse any form of, you know, ill feelings amongst us or create tension. And so that's, that's the atmosphere the I saw when we were discussing the issue. Yeah, so uh, this is... Wanted, everybody saw uh, this that act, there was a uh, um, but we also didn't want to... that we did, CSI did. One. Yes, that, that's how I saw the entire um, discussion. But, Doc, yeah. in playing diplomacy with this, what does it make to the fight that we have on our hands? Wow, that's a very good one. Thank you. So... <laughs> That means that we are being slow in taking action. That's what I, I also observed. Um, so we, we really have to um, come together as a people. I, I, I said that. And then examine everything carefully with what Erastus has put out, with what from Pomanso, with our you know, an elder brother, Dr. Shibe, and all the others, what they were saying we, we really have to be very tactful, bring every stakeholder in, on board, and then get to action. I mean, solving the menace. Yes. Before we get to how we can solve the, 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 the menace and using tact in doing this, a lot of people spoke on the, do, uh, on the day. Now, despite the fact that they, they were diplomatic with their submissions and all, what did you hear on the day that scared you the most or was of concern or bothered you the most? Thank you very much. I mean, you have discussed a lot about the issues or the concerns raised by Prof. Frank Pomansu, so I'll take you a little bit away. What scared me the most was the fact that we didn't have any law preventing us from mining in our forest reserve. You, you, even in the name reserve, that, that means it has been kept for a purpose or we do not have to go there. That is supposed to serve a certain purpose. So I was very shocked when the commissioner was like, well, there is no law that is preventing us from encroaching on such land. So I think it is, it is something that as a nation we'd have to look at and probably quickly put some documentation together or start a process to protect our forest reserve. Doc, knowing the kind of people who are involved in the Galamse, do you foresee this happening anytime soon? Um, yeah, I think we can still dialogue on and, and find ways of, of, you know, if one, if approach A is not working, I think we have to consider another approach. And I keep saying that it's all about dialoguing. I mean, our culture tells us to dialogue a lot when it comes to issues that affect our health, issues that are affecting our environment. We need to bring everyone concerned on board and discuss. We need to open up and let them know that this is deteriorating our environment and killing us as a people. And then we, we begin to now act on the solutions available. As of now, we have solutions, but all of us are acting on it at our own levels, you know, at, at our own level, in a very small way or small pockets. But if we come together, we can do it. We can do it. Doc, I'll come back to you on this question. That, you know, what you touched on, the response you just gave about the fact that we have the solutions, but it at, it's at very small levels. I'll come to that shortly. 